you guys, it's Panda. And um, today I'm doing a vlog, uh, unboxing vlog. And this is a special one because I've been waiting for this for years. And this is only made possible because I have met a few people in my life that are extremely generous and helpful and giving and if it wasn't for them I probably wouldn't have made it this far and this is the only way I'm going to be able to keep doing my videos um, or really participating much in YouTube because my laptop that I had before this is pretty much a boat anchor and I've been uh, trying to get a new one for years and it's just not been possible before um, and I wasn't really aware like as far as I knew up until now I had like the worst credit because I never had a credit card or a lease or anything to build credit with um, but when I went to I got a donation from a really really sweet guy on um, Drunken Peasants uh, fan chat I guess um, he's their, pretty much their number one fan, and I've seen him around a lot on there, and I was chatting, um, about my birthday coming up, which was last month, and about how I was really hoping to do a Drunken Peasants show, um, be a, a guest on their show, like a free guest, because I'm trying to get exposure. And I had previously thought my den dental work was going to be done uh, by my birthday because that's what they told me um, at the dentist. But but they have canceled several times on me, so it was extended, and I'm still waiting for another uh, two appointments before I'll be done. But I had been chatting about trying to get on that show and hoping I could do it around my birthday, but I couldn't, so I was kind of depressed. And this guy, Finn, is so amazing. He just, without even me talking to him, he just offered to send a donation. And so I told him my PayPal, and he just sent me a huge donation. And I've only gotten a huge donation like twice before. And I haven't heard from that guy in a long time, so I was pretty much lost hope that I had, you know, was ever going to be able to get anything expensive again or save money or anything so um, I was really like touched by that and um, I'm not used to it because my family has never been supportive or um, really helping me out that financially even during my birthday or Christmas like I used to get like a Walmart card once a year maybe $50 from my parents once a year usually in something that I didn't need, like a computer part or something, but um, I had stopped getting presents like five years ago, I stopped getting cards, so this was really like exciting for me because I had been trying to do my Patreon and my GoFund so I could get a laptop for the last several years and I just never got that much money at one time, like before the donations I got had to be used for my bills because that's why I needed them that bad. And I still do, I mean I still do have like a hundred dollars a month in bills that I can't really afford because I just don't make that much every month. So it's still kind of stressful but I decided this time because it was for my birthday that I was just gonna, I hear all the time about millennials saying you know treat yourself, get yourself something for your birthday, you know they all do that. And I've never been able to, so like I'm like, you know, fine, this time I'm going to do it because I'm tired of being responsible all the time and never having anything fun happen. And so I was hoping to do a shopping spree type thing or just go on a shopping trip where I could pick out the best laptop or the one I could get with for the best price or whatever. Um, but I didn't have anybody to take me. So I talked to my mom into it because she's the only one who can like take me anywhere. 
because I've, as most of you know, I've never had a car. I never could get a car without somebody co-signing or whatever. Um, so that's never happened, and I probably never will, because that's like a long way off, and I don't know how I'm gonna get there. You know how it goes. As soon as I get a vehicle, I'm I'm out of here, and it's gonna be a road trip vlog every day. So I, I'm really excited for that to happen. That's like my number one goal, as it has been for my whole channel, is to get out of here and do a road trip vlog of me living out of my whatever vehicle I can get my hands on, <laughs> and and you know meeting people and experiencing life for the first time because I've pretty much been locked up, you know, as as um, a medical lab rat type thing because I never had really any freedom or normal normalcy in my life. Um, so it's just been like a, a medical problems and lack of support and lack of people who want to take me out and do things with me or whatever to do fun things. Um, so that was my number one goal. It still is. But hopefully, hopefully now that I have a new laptop, which I'm really honestly tentative about because that's why I haven't really made myself do a video as quickly as I should have because I was so worried about opening it because um, I really didn't pay a lot on it. It's honestly a really expensive um, Microsoft Surface Pro um, and I, I put some down on it and I still have to make monthly payments on it so I'm really worried <laughs> about opening it and was too nervous to do so because I'm like, uh, what if I can't afford it? You know, it's already, I already am going to have problems making the $60 payment or whatever um, every month, so I don't know for sure how that's going to work, but at this point, the only way I can move forward with my channel and social media and so forth is to have a better computer. So whatever it takes, I guess. <laughs> Um, sorry I'm rambling so much, I just wanted to explain the point of the video before I started. And I know you guys are bored to tears already, because it's been a long ass seven and a half minutes. But, um, anyway, I want to thank Finn, and I will definitely link to his, uh, I don't know, channel. He doesn't really have a channel, but, um, if, if Finn's watching this, um, I'm really nervous, but... <laughs> Um, comment below with whatever social media you want me to tag on in the description or whatever because I don't know what you want me to put out but I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart for helping me with this and making it possible for me to keep going um, with something to do because more than likely just like the last two years the my family's gonna ignore the situation and make me stay here another winter and I don't know how I'm going to do it, I really don't, because I, I barely did it the last two winters, but I'm hoping having something to look forward to like this, and having something I can make videos better with, and, and edit videos with, is going to give me something to do. Whether or not I, I'm able to keep my power on is a situation, but um, other than that, I'm hoping I can make it through the winter by by setting goals for videos and trying to do that when I can't go out and when I can't function very well. Um, you guys will just have to bear with me because the biggest problem I have with doing videos is setting it up and getting dressed and trying not to look like a fat slob and, you know, just trying to get it professionally done with the very crappy equipment that I have. So hot in here. My AC has not worked very well for a while. Um, and I'm sweaty and nervous, so you'll have to bear with me. But I'm going to do this unboxing video, and um, I'm definitely going to put in the description where you can skip forward to 10 fucking minutes before I start opening it. <laughs> Sorry, you guys. Maybe I'll try to edit before I post, but let me set my lapel mic here. awkward on a t-shirt. Okay. Sorry if this is a shitty setup. I'm trying to do it before it gets dark. So I don't really have time to get dressed up or much because I've just been feeling like shit lately. So anyway, 
This is the mouse I got. I needed another wireless mouse because I only had one for my um, other computer that's my desktop computer that does not have internet and is actually my dad's computer and I can't really use it for much. So I got myself this one and I'll just open that later because I don't really need to open that right now. Um, so this is the, this is the Surface Pro with type cover and I got it at Best Buy and so I was talking before about my credit and stuff because when I was looking for a laptop I figured just go to Best Buy because they price match now and I haven't been there in like you know six eight years something like that um, but when the Surface came out when the first Microsoft Surface came out I wanted it so fucking bad that was like my dream device for years and I knew you know, the cheapest one was like the Surface RT or something. And I eventually got like a used RT and it was really disappointing. Um, but that was like the cheapest version. And I didn't have all the, like I didn't have good Wi-Fi connection and all that stuff. So at the time it was disappointing and I'm really hoping it's this, um, cause I asked the guy what's best for like YouTube video editing and uploading and downloading and stuff. He pretty much said this was the best, so um, I didn't want to go above $600, so that's pretty much where this is at, and that's why I'm paying like 60 bucks, because um, I have to pay it in like six months or something, but sorry, I'm trying not to sneeze. <laughs> I'm going to sneeze all of a sudden. Um, so I'm, I'm, I'm hoping I can just upload this video because I don't want to spend more time editing and procrastinating. So I apologize for rambling so long. I just really needed to get everything out and let you guys know what this, what the, what the deal is with this. Because this is more than just a, a new device. It's probably the only device I'm going to be able to get for the, for. I mean, I don't want to sound morbid, but I don't expect to be around much longer. So this might be the last device I get. And I'm really hoping it's. Um, it's going to set me forward a lot faster on my channel because, I mean, honestly, guys, I've been told so many times to give it up because it's been six years and I just got like 170 uh, subscribers. So I'm like really dis like discouraged about it. Like, I don't know if it's just, I've been told so many times to just give it up because I've been going so long. But honestly, when it's your last option, it's your only option. Like, it's not my last option. It's pretty much been my only option. Because I was, you know, pretty much a disabled permit for my whole life. And couldn't really go out and do much with no transportation. Couldn't really get a career or anything like that. So it's pretty much been my only option to be a YouTuber or a vlogger or whatever. Um, so I was always hoping to be able to do something like this. Um, actually, the original intent that I wanted to do for a career online is unboxing and reviews. That was the original um, goal I had for YouTube. That's why I started out with asking for anybody to send me anything and I'd unbox it on my channel. And I haven't really gotten very far with that. So This says... Um, Windows 10 Pro i5 processor, 128GB, um, 8GB uh, RAM, let's see, English keyboard with type cover, and Wi-Fi support, Bluetooth, cool. I think I used Windows Pro on the, new, on the desktop my dad sent me, but it's not very... easy to do much without an internet on it. So I got this this little Wi-Fi antenna thing. This little USB little tiny thing that might help with my connection so I can actually do streaming. Ooh, it smells good. Okay. This is a type cover it looks like. Nice chemically smell. 
like this. My, one of my favorite smell fragrances smells is the smell of a new book or magazine or CD book. I love the smell of CD books when they're new. It's like my. It's a nice gray suede type cover. Ooh, it smells like a a new car or something. <laughs> Not that I would know what a new car smells like. Um, okay. And what else do we have? It's not a sticky thing. It's just a piece of glass. I like peeling off the sticky uh, thing on your phone and stuff. Okay. Cord. A booklet. Pretty heavy, pretty solid. I don't know how well the camera works on these, but that would be cool if I could do live streaming on here. I have to get a decent webcam for for live streaming if it doesn't work too well. It's, I don't really like having like super HD video of me anyway. It's not like I'm anything special to look at. Um, I love how this kickstand works. I had that on my RT. That was one of my favorite things. So you can just stand it up. You don't have to, I think there's a release somewhere. I don't remember. There we go. And you don't have to have like a case for it. I'll probably get a case though because I, I'm super paranoid about protecting my device. There's not even a sticky thing. What's up with that? I thought that was like a given on all your devices. That's like a part of the fun is peeling that off. Okay. Probably have to plug it in before I can test it. I think I won't. I'll th I think I'll do a different video for like review because it's already long enough. I, I gabbed way too long. I'm sorry about that. I should have been like at least in front of the camera, but I, I look like shit, so I really don't want to be in front of the camera. Now, this I remember when I was looking when I when I do um, I do a lot of research for before I purchase anything. This time I didn't really because I was kind of in a hurry. Um, but I remember from before like researching these when I was trying to get one. And I remember the power cord being, or the pow this power pack thing being the worst complaint that everybody had of it because it's a unique charger like Apple has, kind of like that. It's um, it's got this magnetic like thing to it that goes snaps into your into your device. And if this gets bent, like I can tell this by the way the cord feels because I have Samsung phone with this kind of a cord and if it bends at all in any direction it like gets a short in it and it's really hard to keep it from like when I got my RT it was really hard to keep this from falling out so hopefully they fixed all that I mean I'm usually really careful anyway but if you want to charge this on the go you got to be really careful with the cord and I'll probably have to get a smaller cord to take to charge it with on the road because this is an insanely big cord like I mean I guess it's a laptop so you have to expect it's a tablet laptop I guess but you have to expect it to have a bigger cord than a phone I guess I wish they would like hurry up and invent a, a phone type cord for the for these things because that would be awesome if it was smaller and you didn't need this thing like it'd be so nice to just have a phone cord type charger for this but that's a, that's a really, I, I actually got one of the, the USB charge cords you can get that are like this. They make phone ones that are thinner, but they're flat and wide and really thick like that. And um, I got a charge cord like this that was purple. And like within a week it stopped working because this kind of a cord, you have to be really careful with bending it. And it just like gets shorts in it really easy. They make it feel like it's really fancy cord. It's really thick, uh, like 
heavy rubber type cord, but it, it's so fragile, I'm afraid it'll stop working. But like with the Nook, when I had my Nook, if the cord stopped charging, they would send you one for free, so maybe they'll do that if it ever stops working. But anyway, that's pretty much it, I'm assuming, that's in here. Instructions and crap. It's not like I ever read those. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm hoping pretty soon I can afford to get like a case for it and like a charger for the for the road because those are probably the two most important things I would want right now for this because I it's not like I'm on the road anyway I guess I'm just I'm one of those people when I go out especially since it's not me driving and I don't know what my mom's gonna do she wants to just spend all day going somewhere else there's not much I can do about it <laughs> so I'm the kind of person who likes to take you know a car charger an extra battery you know like a, a charging stick or whatever that you can have ready for charging your phone all that stuff I take with me all the time um, and my mom only takes like her cigarettes and her phone that doesn't have a case on it at all or any like charger she just brings her cigarettes and her phone and her keys she never has anything with her so I always bring a lot of stuff with me like that yeah, this is cool. I'm excited. Is that an extra USB charge? Extra USB charge there. That's cool. So you can put. I wonder why there's a USB on the. I thought you'd plug it into your tablet if you wanted to charge it. I'll have to look into that. Because there's a USB here, but there's only one. There's legit only one USB, so I bet that that one must be for charging. Because this one must be, this one must be for just trans, uh, transferring files and stuff. I have to do, legit get a screen protector too, because that's annoying. I always put a screen protector on as soon as I get a new new phone or whatever. So I'm gonna wanna definitely get one for that. So yeah, that's kind of annoying. I love having USB ports. Um, so if I need to use my mouse and something else, I'm going to have to get one of those multiple USB things that I can put, um, in there and then plug in multi- hopefully that'll work. I, I think I remember it being a problem with the RT, like you couldn't plug in more than one thing. Even if you had one of those, I don't think it worked. I'll have to look into that. Crap. Anyway, um, that probably won't be... If there's, if there's a card slot, yeah, I think there is, <clears throat> so I won't have to like plug in my phone to transfer video, that would probably work, um, but yeah, I can't wait to try my, my streaming and see if I can start streaming video, um, but yeah, that's about it. I will do a separate review video after I get it set up and everything, and find out how it works and I might actually I was planning on doing a TYT commentary where I'm gonna record the video I'm watching of them and comment on it so I might do that on here because that would work a lot better on here okay well um, if you guys have any comments or you want me or if you know anything about this device you want me to know if you are a YouTube uh, comment uh, if you're a YouTube creator, rather, um, let me know what you use, what software you use, what device you, you think is the best, and if you have any, any information about this, like some cool tricks or anything, let me know. Yes, I'll probably definitely YouTube stuff like that, too, because I always, before I buy stuff like this, I always look up, like, YouTube videos and reviews and... Um, unboxings and all that so I'll probably still do that and see what people have to say about like the tips and tricks you can use on this um, and I'll probably upload this video as soon as I can I apologize for once again not I, not being able to edit a lot of the bull crap out because I talked way too much um, but it was I was kind of trying to inform everybody what was going on so once again, I want to thank Finn for this, for making this possible, and I'm excited to try it out, and I'll go plug it in now, and 
maybe I'll Snapchat it later or post pictures on my Twitter. You guys can always follow my Twitter for, for pretty much daily updates. Um, and I uploaded a couple of thunderstorm videos the other day. I have a couple of like critter nature uh, videos to put up. But once this gets up and going, I'm going to be uploading more because I can finally start doing editing and working on my huge list of goals that I had for the last year or so that I haven't really been working on. So um, if you have any requests for videos or questions for me to answer in a video, uh, let me know in the comments. And if you're not subscribed, please subscribe. I have to get to... I think it's 10,000, I'm hoping it's 1,000 subscribers um, before I can get like sponsors and raise money and all that stuff. And I can't really get much further as far as getting out of here and getting on the road and getting healthier before I can raise money. So um, I want to do like live streams where I can get like, you know, super chats. And I don't want to sound like, this sounds really greedy, um, I don't want to sound greedy. But I see everybody getting super chats, even when they don't ask for them and they just get sh crap loads of super chats every time they do a live stream. And I don't want crap loads of super chats. I just want to be able to afford my bills for now. And if I can get enough content provided for all of you, that's, that's my main goal, then hopefully people will be more willing to, you know, help me along so I can afford to pay a monthly car lease because that's pretty much the only way I'm going to get a vehicle if I can afford to and I can show to somebody that I can afford to um, then they might you know co-sign for me but either way I need to get some more income in each month it's not like a one-time donation thing that I'm looking for I'm looking for just enough support each month that I can afford to add a car lease and then get out of here and not have to pay the bills for this place anymore because <laughs> my family's okay I don't want to go into a ramble about that but you know you know how it is my family doesn't think I can afford a car now so they're not gonna help me get into a car and get rid of this place that's the problem they're, they're saying I have to afford a car now with all of my other bills before I can get out of here and live in a car <laughs> so that's the problem in a nutshell I guess but yeah, so I'm, my only option right now is trying to get everybody's, um, you know, sponsor sponsorship or support, um, and I need to provide content that you guys want, and I don't know what you guys want. If you want more unboxings, I need to be able to, I was mainly, originally I should say, my first video about weed tubing was, I'd love to get a subscription box, a WeTube subscription box every month, just one a month, and I could unbox it every month on my channel, and then send all the stuff that's in it to other people who can't afford stuff, so that was my main goal, um, and I'd love to be able to do that, and that's just a once a month video. I also have um, a list that I posted on my Twitter and my Snapchat of my goals for my videos. So if you want to know what all my goals are for my channel, you can look at that because I don't want to sit here another half an hour and talk. Um, and if you have any suggestions or requests, let, let me know in the comments. And I'm sorry again for rambling so much. And I hope you guys are still watching and leave a thumbs up and let me know how, you, how your summer's going and all that. And I'll talk to you guys next time. Thanks for watching.